multiple people in a, in the in the the chat that have asked why don't they throw jump balls and and things of that nature and here here is the flip side of that because i do understand the aggressive nature of going after it right trying to get the touchdown trying to score it so on and so forth but when you talk about a 50 50 ball right so 50 percent is your guy coming down with it but what a lot of people kind of forget about or or don't bring into the 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 fold is what if the defender comes down with it right so you have driven down the right you you're running the ball jj's dialing it up and in playing well and in you're moving the ball and you get down in the red zone and you're on the 10 yard line and you then at that point draw throw a 50 50 ball and a corner just makes a really good play and now michigan state's got the ball at the 20 mark you know what i mean like that i like i understand it. i get it you want to be aggressive but at the same time too when you when you look at the games that we've wanted more from i mean it's games where michigan in in to try to speak from jim harbaugh's mindset and and point of view listen we've got this game in the bag as long as we just don't mess it up right so let's not take chances in the red zone and i get it everybody wants touchdowns i understand that 100 percent. i want touchdowns trust me i want them to score touchdowns but at the same time too i do understand listen if we can run it and get in great if not listen I mean, let's let's kick it because guess what at this point michigan state has seven points and they haven't even threatened us anything outside of that yeah, right and that, and that was basically two big two two big boy balls from uh, uh coleman right so it's it so i i i understand i understand it because guys trust me when we first got on this channel a year ago we i mean before that right but preseason in the summer of last year we were th that was that was me i was i was in that spot of just saying man this isn't gonna work you gotta you, you gotta why, get after right? it you gotta be aggressive and i guess but you know why? And I want you, you're rolling right now. I want you to keep rolling. Mm -hmm. The reason why we were like that, and, it, and it's hard to fully accept and just be okay with how Harbaugh runs his offense or the philosophy that he wants his offense ran, is really does go against the grain of pretty much the majority of college football, especially, you know, the, the big boys. You know, um, and, and look, there, there are pros to the way Harbaugh likes to run his offense, and there are definitely cons to, you know, how other teams do, like Tennessee, a very high octane offense. Um, well, anytime you have an offense like that, you know, even if you're scoring at a pretty high rate, you're putting your defense back on the field pretty pretty fast, and they can get worn out. I mean, that's why the Pac-12 uh, statistically has high offensive scoring and terrible defensive rankings, because you know, their offense is always their offense is getting on and off the field scoring and their defense is constantly on the field and it's just like this terrible, you know, combination. And why it's also hard for them to win against teams that are more balanced, if you will, right? Uh, like in the SEC and you know, so on and so forth. So you no know, one is saying that, but it just feels like, man, you know, when, when Michigan Harbaugh is very unique in how he likes to he, Michigan is unique because they have pretty much the same talent or somewhere near the same talent as those upper echelon programs, but yet they they run their offense like a program that's limited, like a Wisconsin, if you will. You know what I'm trying to say? Like, So it's like this weird area, and it's good enough that they're going to win 90% of their games most of the time because they do have the better guys on their side. Uh, but you just worry, like, man, you know, well, what if we do get in the game where the other team is scoring a little bit more easier on our defense? Can we really keep up and attract me? You know, can we? You know, and that's the that, that's where it makes you uncomfortable, you know, just accepting the way we do we do run an offense, you know? Yeah, and I, and I was thinking about it earlier today, and uh, before I get to that, uh, Chris, thank you so much for contributing to the show. Says hi, Dre. How about us finally getting some luck against Michigan State in the punting game? That's that. 
pretty funny i do well, that's like actually that. uh i gotta get a double shout out that's my boy it's my boy chris um okay. yeah not met him does but uh uh maybe we, we you know when he comes you know into town you know i'll hook you up with him but that's my guy uh my friend going back to freshman year of college thank you brother for joining uh, nice. and, uh thank you thank watching. you